So I wanted to start by giving you guys a quick story. And this is kind of the pinnacle of what emotional intelligence can do for us. And it's about a guard dog and a wise owl. It seems odd, but it's the combination of these two that make a big difference. And the story starts out with a little girl who just got back from a formal event. She has a pretty little dress on and she really wants to just de-stress because you know how little kids are. They don't really like that scenario and they just want to de-stress and relax. And she was ready when she got home, she was ready to go jump in the pool. And her parents said, that's fine. Just let's go get your bathing suit on. Complete meltdown. She didn't want to put her bathing suit on. She just wanted to jump in and relax and enjoy herself. Or maybe just jump in naked. She didn't care. She just wanted to get out of the setting and into a setting that she's more familiar with. She just melted down, crying. The parents were trying to rationalize with her, and they couldn't do anything. So finally, they took a break and let her cry, and we're talking about what they're going to do. And pretty soon, a little while later, she noticed that they didn't hear the girl crying. And as a parent, you know, as soon as they're quiet, it's, it's a pro, it's something's going on, right? So they look, and just as they get back in the hallway, they see the little girl come down with her bathing suit on. And the parents were flabbergasted. They're like, you just had this huge meltdown, and now, ab abracadabra, you have this, the, the bathing suit on? And she, well, she said, you know, I learned at school that we have a barking dog part of our brain. And my barking dog part of my brain was really, really loud. I didn't, I didn't want to put my bathing suit on, but I realized that I needed to calm down and call in my wise owl part of my brain where I can think about making good choices. And I realized that I didn't want to get my, my pretty dress all wet. I didn't want to swim naked, so I put my bathing suit on. Can I go swimming now? <laughs> and that's the power of giving children techniques and strategies on how to help themselves without always needing the hand of a parent. And that is something that benefits students. And it is definitely beneficial for, for parents and children. And that is why emotional intelligence is really going to help everybody, regardless of who you are. But obviously, educators and parents, it makes a big difference. 